Hey guys, so this is just another random pregnancy journal entry or whatever. Uh, I just wanted to say it is so freaking nice. I actually have a day off of work today, like that I didn't ask for. It's like, like a lot of, t every other Saturday I have off. So that leaves um, the other weeks I usually end up, like I have to have every other Saturday off because the kids are here. Um, so I have to make sure I can watch them. And every other Saturday they're with their dad. So the other weeks, a lot of times like he ends up scheduling me for six days a week, but this week I actually got today off, which is a Wednesday, and I've gotten a lot of cleaning done. It's been really, really nice. I've been feeling quite a bit better. I feel a little not super great right now. Probably need to eat some more actual food. I was also dumb, and I ate like Zaxby's today, which is like super fast food, like, you know, like just the stuff that makes you just feel terrible, so... That, and then along with, like, I ate two of these little tiny, like, swirls-type ice cream chocolate cone thingies and some milk duds, and sugar has not been good for me this pregnancy. I don't know if it, it affected me much with Mason or Serenity, um, but I have absolutely noticed this time that when I eat, like, sugar, I can tell you I never feel better after I eat sugar, and most of the time my stomach is a little, like, the after I eat it, like... <laughs> So, but I still do it anyways, especially now that I'm starting to feel a little bit better to the point where even if I eat it and feel a little like this for a little while, it's not usually going to make me throw up. So, Tiggy is here as usual. I think it's really sweet too when I was thinking about how um, she's been with me since before I had any kids. Like, Tiggy's birthday was the other day, April 8th, so... She just turned eight years old. She's just a little bit older than Serenity. So she was with me with every pregnancy and she still loves to sit with me. Um, if I can find a clip, I will insert it from when she used to sit with me when I was pregnant with Serenity. I have some on Facebook, I think. So But yeah, I just thought that was really, really sweet that she's been here through my pregnancies with all three kids, even though my first pregnancy, I was 20. I am now 28. So eight years, just like eight years of her being here and experiencing every single time I've had a baby in my belly. So yeah, but like... I don't have anything necessarily particular to say. I just wanted to say it's nice to have a day off. I've got a lot of cleaning done that I wasn't able to do because I was so sick before. And like I, you know, I work like six days a lot of times on the weeks when, um, when I don't have the Saturday off. So yesterday I cleaned the laundry room. It took me an hour to clean it how I wanted because that's where the cats stay when we have to like go somewhere for a while or whatever. So that's where they stay. That's where their litter box is. And they've just, it just, it is awful. I, I've been wanting to like deep clean it so bad for so long, but I just, that was one of something I could not do because I had no energy. I was sick. Like trying to clean up litter and nasty stuff when you're sick and have no energy is, I, I could not do it physically. So I did it yesterday and it made me feel so much better. And then today I've done dishes, um, a good bit of laundry, um, cleaned up the kitchen um, quite a bit, my bathroom, like. I feel super productive today, but yeah, so I just wanted to hop on here and make a little update. Obviously, my actual update will be in two days, but me and Tiggy just wanted to stop in and say hey. And that I am like either 149 or 150 days away from my due date, which still feels incredibly far away. And then when I think about, I keep thinking, wow, I'm almost halfway there. And then I'm like, wow, I'm only halfway there. <laughs> Not even yet. And then you also have to realize that when you take a pregnancy test, I took one as early as possible. I was already like three and a half weeks pregnant. So you knock that off and it's like, I've really only known I was pregnant for like 15 weeks now, 15 weeks. And I have like 20, like basically 21 to go unless the baby 
wants to be an August baby and come early or even come like on like September 1st or 2nd or something. But <clears throat> I doubt that. I highly doubt it. I'm going to say right now, I don't think that's going to happen. I'm probably going to end up being un induced just like I was with the other two. Those went so well that that's perfectly fine with me though. I mean, I've been so, so, so lucky to have two really good births aside from just a few minor things like almost passing out twice with Mason because my blood pressure dropped so low, but and then, like, I threw up with both of them in the transition phase, but never had anything life-threatening, never had to go have a C-section, like, no cord wrapped around their neck. I didn't have any, had any, like, hemorrhage problems. I haven't had, like, horrific contractions um, to where I couldn't make it to the hospital or where I was too late to get an epidural so far. <laughs> but anyways, yeah, I just wanted to come on here and make a quick update, so... I'm watching Survivor right now. Finally got logged back into Hulu after I got the kid's dad to give me the... He gave me the right password and, like, email combo. Because when I tried it when we first moved in, I was using, like, the, my email for some reason. And I just... I, I gave up. But... So now, by the time I got back on here, there's, like, two seasons loaded on. And it's, like, my favorite show ever. So, it was kind of worth it to, like, not be able to watch it. Because now I can binge it. And the chances that I actually get to watch TV. So, yeah. I'm going to stop now. I don't want these things to be super long. And Tiggy say, we'll see you later. And we will be back for more videos soon.